I'm Mackenzie and welcome back to my channel. Um, excuse my hair right now. Um, today we're going to try out the fast hair straightener. It is a straightener and a brush all in one. So there was a video going around Facebook and um, a girl was uh, stroking this through her hair and her hair went from wavy to straight. And I know a lot of curly girls were wondering if this could straighten their hair. So um, I wanted to test it out two ways. On one side I straightened my hair but not very well so I want to see if it can fix that and then on the other side it's just combed out into an afro basically. So we're going to be testing both sides. This heats up to 230 degrees Celsius which is about 400 and 46 degrees Fahrenheit. I'm going to do it at the highest setting so I can see if I can get the best results. Um, in the directions it does say make sure your hair is thoroughly combed out and just to glide this through your combed out hair. So we will try the curly, well not the curly, the brushed out side first. And if you see me looking this way my mirror is over here. so. Um, just to make sure everything is thoroughly combed out and there are no tangles, I will be brushing all the way through it. Okay, so as you can see, there are no tangles in my hair. I'm getting right through my hair. You are not allowed to take a piece that big, so I'm going to do about half of this in the Put it on the side. Okay. So let me comb through this one more time. Okay. Now that it is combed through, we will take the brush straightener and see what happens. So that is um that is one go through through my hair. So it doesn't seem, I, you know, my hair isn't actually very hot either, which is kind of weird. The back of this is pretty hot. I can still touch it, but it's hot. So I'm thinking that maybe it's not all the way heated up. Um, it's been on for about five minutes. So I figured it would have been hotter by now, but we will try again. So it doesn't seem to really be doing anything to the side of my hair other than kind of brushing out the curls. So it went from this to this. Oh, and I have a heat protectant on my hair, so didn't worry. Okay, um, maybe we can go to the side with my hair kind of straight. Oh, by the way, this was uh, $30 on Amazon. Um, I'll put a link in the description box if you guys want to try it. Um, it seems, so far I'm thinking that this works on wavy Caucasian type hair. But anyways, let us go to this side. So as you can see, this side is semi-straight. It got a little away from being in that, um, that little body thin thing I had going on. So since my hair is a lot thinner when it is straight, I'm just gonna go ahead and try to brush through all of this. And if it doesn't work, then I'll do half of what I have right now. So I'm going to start from the roots and slowly glide through my hair. So as you can see, it got like the 
bumps out so it's not bumpy but it didn't take so I would compare what my hair is right now to if I step down to humidity this is what it would look like and this doesn't seem to be giving me that silky smooth you know flat iron that I like so we'll try again So I'm trying to show you guys getting all my hair through the brush and I'm slowly gliding it through. So it kind of fixed it. I would say that this, you have to run it through a few times to even get it decently straight. But I would say that this is more of a brush that you would use to fix your flat iron so like your hair is done or you had curls um, and like one night and then next morning you want your hair to be straight again uh, maybe run through this this through your hair a few times and it will go back to straight but going from a like straight blow dry to a perfect flat iron this is not going to do that um, I probably won't be returning it only because um you know i work out and when my hair is straight i do i don't like to always put direct heat to my hair but this doesn't actually make my hair um too hot to the touch so like when i run through it i can still touch my hair as opposed to when i use a flat iron i can't touch my hair after i run it through so this would be nice post workout you want to fix your hair up you know just run it through a couple times um but getting your hair bone straight is not what's going to happen with this because i like my hair way straighter than this this is a little a little puffy for my my liking um i'm gonna go try this side one more time take that piece that i used before <laughs> i look crazy okay and try to run this through um, it's not getting it that straight. No. Nope. I mean, the panels in the brush are pretty freaking hot. Like when I touched it, that did burn. And I couldn't imagine, anybody with coarser hair than mine or thicker hair than mine, this definitely is not gonna work because I have very fine, thin hair and it's, it can't even get through little pieces. So, like I said before, this is something you would touch up your pressed hair with. Um, you wouldn't try to straighten your whole head with this. It, it wouldn't work unless you want it to look like this. This is what it would look like if you straightened your whole head with this. Um, and this is what it looks like touching up a bad straightening job. So, you know, it's not really working. Um, this is just brushing it through all of that hair on this side. And it is not doing anything for me. So, um, I would give this probably a five out of 10 for black girl's hair only because it would be useful to touch up your hair with um, but I don't see why you couldn't just take a flat iron and go through your hair this it would take the same amount of time to heat it up and go through your hair as this would and it would probably do a better job so that is my review of that Thanks for watching my review of the Fast Hair Straightener. Um, I'm going to see if there are more expensive ones on Amazon and uh, maybe those will work better and I'll link those below. Um, if there's anything else that you guys want me to review or anything gimmicky you want me to try on curly hair, um, I'd be glad to do it. Um, don't forget to subscribe and comment below and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks. Bye.